everyone, it's Janet here with another design team project for Beverly at The Piece by Piece. And her store can be found at www.thepiecebypiece.com. And for this project, I made some hearts on a stick. And Beverly's laces and trims are just perfect for Valentine's Day because it's really nice to have really good quality trims and laces to put on Valentine's projects. And so this is what I did. The first one, I just put on one of these little skewer sticks and I painted the stick pink. And here at the base I have some of the beautiful silk ribbon that Beverly now carries. She carries it in the cream and the black and a taupe. And then one of her little heart buckles right here. And then this idea I took from Van. She put did a little project for me and she put one of the little pieces of the other trim, felt heart trim that Beverly sells and put it right here in the center. So for this one I used one of the little metal heart shape things from Maya Road and I punched a hole in the top and down here in the bottom and I ran the skewer right through it so it's real secure. And then I have some paper in the background. The paper I used for this one was the Authentic Lovely Collection. So I have that in the background. And then I used some of this pink trim from Beverly Store around the edges. And it's perfect for this because it, it goes around the edges really well without looking frumpy. So that turned out really nice. And then I have a little <clears throat> plastic heart chip back here. And a little, I cut up some of Beverly's little cream trim and I'll put the links to everything down below. They're little teeny flowers and I have a couple of them behind here and a little um, sweetheart blossom here. And this little owl is from Beverly's store too. Isn't it just adorable? And the, I put some little eyes in there from just some trim. And on canvas I printed Owl Always Love You with a heart. And then in the back here I have some of this beautiful pink trim. It's a tulle trim. And so I have it on the back. And I just glued it around the back inside of here. And in the back I put in some more of the paper and I put in some of this beautiful trim from Beverly's store. This actually has beautiful hearts on it and comes in pink and red. And then I just tucked in some little pieces from the collection. It would be a great place to tuck in a little note too for like a Valentine's card. So I was really happy with the way it turned out. Something a little different, a little unique, which everyone knows I like to do things like that. So <clears throat> the second one I did in more the blacks and the pink colors. And this is from an older collection, the Be Mine Echo Park collection. And I used the papers from that collection. And this one I just, just put on a stick. And I left the black back plain so you could see how I did. I'll probably end up covering up the back. I'll put um, foam tape here and then putting another piece on top. But I just wanted to see, wanted you to see how I did it. And I kind of gathered the black lace trim all the way around. I used some red line tape and just kind of gathered it because this is a, a black flat lace from Beverly's store. So just gathered it up and that's the back of the thing. So I will cover it to make it all finished. And I'll probably in, as well there put a note on the back, a little pocket and a note. And at the bottom here, I used some of this gorgeous trim. It's a black lace, little flowers on it, and some pink, bright pink seam binding. And then one of Beverly's beautiful rosettes. And she's also carrying the wheat sprays now. And these are gorgeous colors. It's the pink to, goes to the white and the black to the gray. So it was perfect for this paper. And then this is one of her resin pieces, the black resin piece. This is a picture of my husband and I taken on my birthday last year on the cruise. So I thought the colors were perfect for this. And then just a little ticket that says, I love you. So really simple and easy to make, but really nice. You could stick them in a bouquet of flowers. You could just stick them in an arrange, already existing arrangement to kind of add <clears throat> some Valentine decorations to your house. So. Anyway, and the third one is done real simply. This stick here I painted red. It's a little same as the other pink stick. Put some cream seam binding and some red and used another one of those heart ribbon sliders and put one of 
Bev's little pearl pieces in the center. So that is that. And on this one I just took some canvas and I stitched around. I actually didn't stitch around the whole thing. Um, I just stitched around the top so that I could get it real nice and even. And I just used my fabric glue to put it together and I stuffed the inside with a little, some little pieces, scrap pieces of muslin, light muslin that I had just to give a little bit of puff in the center. And so the stick is sticking up inside of there. And on this one I just layered some of Beverly's beautiful trim. So here's that same trim that was in the other one, pink. This is the red. And this is the felt trim that she has. And it was this little center piece that I used on the other one in the ribbon slider. So there's this beautiful, and this, these are hearts on here. And then this beautiful red felt trim along here. And then I've used some of this before. This is a beautiful cream with kind of a bow. And like I said, I will have all the links down below. And then she just got in these new resin pieces, and they're just beautiful. It was a pale pink color, and I just dry brushed it with red on top to kind of show the detail. So it's real simple, but I really like how it turned out. So I have started a blog. It's still kind of a work in progress. I'm going to have to get some help with it. But anyway, I will have all the links and pictures on the blog as well. And my blog is Creative and Elegant Inspiration at blogspot.com. So if anyone's interested, they can check that out too. And I'll have the links to everything down below. But thanks again for watching. Have a great week. Bye.